Fierce Holly Willoughby has gone cold over ITV dancing on ice amid crisis of confidence. Holly Willoughby has told pals that she wants to present dancing on ice, but ITV bosses fear she may have gone cold on the idea following an alleged plot to kidnap and murder her. ITV bosses want Holly Willoughby to get her skates on and decide if she will host Dancing on Ice within the next two weeks. Holly, 42, has told pals that she wants to present the celebrity ice skating show, which will return to our screens in January. But ITV fears she may have gone cold on the idea. Sources say Holly is suffering a crisis of confidence over her comeback. She has not appeared on TV since she quit this morning in October following an alleged plot to kidnap and murder her. No Holly would mean an entirely new presenting team for Dancing on Ice as Philip Schofield, who quit ITV in May after admitting he lied about an affair with a male colleague, has been replaced by Stephen Mulhern. I'm a celeb contestant Josie Gibson, 38, and singer Rochelle Humes, 34 who have both hosted this morning, are thought to be in the running to replace Holly. An ITV source said, Holly is very much our first choice, but we're fast approaching the point where we need to know if she will be back. There are almost no requirements on the host before the shows begin, but we will need to sort out a replacement if she isn't returning. We have been very anxious to not put pressure on her as she was really rocked by the alleged kidnap plot. But time is ticking and we really need to know by the end of this month. A second source said, Holly is really on the fence about this decision, and has been going back and forth over it for some time. She does love the show, but is having a real crisis of confidence and has barely been seen out since she left this morning. She's spending all her time at home with her family, to go back to primetime TV seems a big step. She is not sure she's ready. A source close to Holly said she has not been given a formal deadline by ITV. A man who denies the alleged kidnap and murder plot is due to stand trial in June.